Okay, Assalamualaikum dan selamat sejahtera uh, Cikgu Mak Cikgu Puan Diana akan mengajar matematik tingkatan 3 Okay, we are going to start our lesson with chapter 1 uh, Chapter 1 The title is Indices Indices Okay, this is part 1 our learning standard for this part to represent repeated multiplication in index form and describe its meaning. Okay. Index notation. What is repeated multiplication in index form? Okay. In form 1, you have learned that 4 cube equals to 4 times 4 times 4. Number 4 cube is written in index notation. 4 is the base. And 3 is the index or exponent. The number is read as 4 to the power of 3. Hence, The number in index notation or in index form can be written as a to the power of n where a is the base and n we call it as index or power. You have also learned that 4 square equals to 4 times 4 and 4 cube equals to 4 times 4 times 4. For example, 4 times 4 equals to 4 square. The value of index is 2. The value of index is the same as the number of times 4 is multiplied equally. 4 times 4 times 4 equals to 4 cube. So 3 here is the index. And repeated 3 times. Look, uh, let's look at the example one. Write the following repeated multiplication in the form of a to the power of n. This is the repeated multiplication. Okay, we want to write it as a to the power of n, where a is the, ba uh, the base, n is the index. Okay, let's try a. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 5 is repeated 6 times. So, we write it as 5 to the power of 6. Same goes to B, C, D, E and F. So, for example, A, we write as 5 to the power of 6. For B, 0 0.3 to the power of 1, 2, 3, 4. So, to the power of 4. How about this? Okay. This is negative 2 to the power of 3. Okay. For fraction, you must write in the bracket 1 over 4. To the power of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, to the power of 5. Okay, why we have to use bracket to write 1 over 4? Because if you write it as 1 over 4 to the power of 5, uh, there will be a misunderstanding. Understanding. People might think that this is 1 to the power of 5 over 4. Okay, understand? So, this is the answer. Next. From the solution in example 1, it is, for, it, is, it is found that the value of index is an index from is the same as the number of times the base is multiplied repeatedly. In general, a to the power of n equals to a times a times a n factors where a not equals to 0. 
Okay, you can try homework, my test 1.1a, you will do in your match 1. Okay, so next, uh, move on to our learning standard, our next learning standard to rewrite a number in index form and vice versa. How do you convert a number into a number in index form? A number can be written in index form if a suitable base is selected. You can use repeated division method or repeated multiplication method to convert a number into a number in index form. Okay, example 2, write 64 in index form using the base of 2, base of 4 and base of 8. Okay, we use uh, the first method which is division method, repeated division method. Okay, simple. This method is simple. For example, you want base 2. So you just, I will show here. So let's say you want uh, base 2, 64 in base 2. Okay. So first you divide by 2. 64 divided by 2, 32. Then you divide again, 2. 32 divided by 2, 16. Again, divided by 2, 8. Divided by 2, 4. 2 until you get the last answer is 1. So, you just come here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, the answer, 2 to the power of 6. Okay? Same goes, if you want to place of 4, you just divide by 4. Then, and here is 3. So, 4 to the power of 3. If you want base 8, then you divide by 8. Okay, this is repeated multiplication method. If you want base 2, you just write 2 times 2, 4. 4 times 2, 8. 8 times 2, 16. 16 times 2, 32. 32 times 2, 64. So, you just come here and then you write 2 to the power of 6. This one you can choose which uh, which method you like when you do your homework. Okay, how about the fraction? Write 32 over 3,001 to 5 in index form using base of 2 over 5. If you choose a repeated division method, just divide by 2 and 5. You divide by 2 with uh, 32 the denominator here and, and then the denominator you divide by 5 so you give the same answer the same repeated so just write the answer here 2 over 5 don't forget your bracket to the power of 5 also you can use repeated multiplication method ok you can try now your homework mind test 1.1 B. Okay, next. How do you determine the value of the number in index form A to the power of N? The value of A to the power of N can be determined by repeated multiplication method or using a scientific calculator. For example, calculate the value of given number in index form 2 to the power of 5 and 0 0.6 to the power of 3. Okay, this is by using repeated multiplication 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 5 times and then you get the answer 32. Same goes here. 0 0.6 times uh, 3 times and then you get the answer 0 0.216. If you want to use calculator, okay, I'll show you how to use calculator. Okay, I have calculator here. 
you also can uh, cut your calculator. Let's say you want to calculate 5 to the power of 4. You want to find the value. So this is the button you have to press. And you want to calculate uh, power greater than 2 or 3. If you want to calculate 2 to the power of 2 or 2 square, just click here. So it equals to 4. If you want 2 cube, you just shift. Then you get the so if you want um, the power greater than 2 and 3, use the symbol here, the symbol. So let's say 5 to the power of 4. So 5 to the power of 4. So the calculator will give the answer 625. How about negative 7 cube? This one, you must follow, you must uh, use bracket. So bracket negative 7 close bracket to the power of 3 you can choose whether you want to use shift here or you can use this symbol to the power of 3 so the calculator will give the answer negative 343 for fraction also you have to to use bracket the so bracket 2 over 3 close bracket to the power of 4 and equal. So the answer 16 over 81. For example, D also bracket 1 3 over 5 close bracket to the power of 2 so equals to 14 over 25. Here, uh, the answer show uh, give you in the form of improper fraction. So, if you want the calculator give you in improper fraction, just uh, press shift and then this button A, B, C. Then the calculator will give the answer in the form of improper fraction. Example E, bracket negative 0 0.5 close bracket to the power of 6. Then the calculator will give the answer 0 0.015625. Okay, clear? So next, do homework mind test 1.1c. Okay, that's all for this video. See you in the next video. Bye.